I am Anil Kumar. I have taken a few questions to review so that we can prepare for our test on probability. The question here is, an integer is chosen at random from 1 to 30, inclusive, right? So 1 and 30 are included. What is the probability that the integer is not a perfect square? So here in a sample space, how many elements are there? Numbers from 1 to 30 makes it 30, right? Now we need to find how many numbers are perfect squares within this. So numbers which are perfect square are 1 square is 1, 2 square, I should actually write here, 1 square is 1, 2 square is 4, 3 square is 9, 4 square is 16, 5 square is 25. So numbers are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, right? So we have 5 numbers which are perfect squares and therefore the probability of event A is 5 out of 30, correct? So which could be simplified as 1 over 6. Now as a practice question, you can change the question to not a perfect square to not a perfect cube, okay? So here the question is, an integer is chosen at random from 1 to 30 inclusive what is the probability that integer is not a perfect square? Well, this is the prob probability where it is a perfect square. So this is, it is a perfect square, right? This is what we found. We need not a perfect square, so we need complement of this. That should be 1 minus 1 over 6. That is 6 minus 1 over 6 or 5 over 6, right? So our answer is, the probability is 5 over 6 for the number not being a perfect square, right? Now, let me change this question. Uh, let, let's say question for you is not a perfect cube, okay? So we just change this question. So do this question now. You can adopt the same method. I'm Anil Kumar. I hope that helps. Thank you. And... All the best.